Jones. Here's Molly. Well, Sean, this Tar Heels team is inspired by something much bigger than football. In practice this week, head coach Matt Brown announced that wide receiver. What went into your decision to make the change at quarterback early in this game? Just missed some throws first two drives. So, you know, we knew we were going to put him in third or fourth series. And, you know, he went in and he never came out. So, uh, tried to do that in Notre Dame game, threw a pick. And, hey, this was the time. So, really proud of him. Proud of the guys making plays. Big stop by the defense there. Hold him to a field goal and a good two-minute drive right there. Long way to go. This team can score a bunch of points quick. Is Cade Klubnick your quarterback for the rest of this game? Yeah, it'll be his, be his game. Yes. Right. UNC's head coach, Matt Brown, said Clemson's change at quarterback absolutely changed everything in this game because they knew how to affect DJ Uyunglele and took away his confidence, but they're still figuring out how to take away Cade Klubnick's confidence. He said, we're going to have to light him up, blitz him, and get after him to win. 11 win season is the eighth for Dabo Sweeney his 14 full seasons as coach of the Tigers. And he is with Molly McGrath. Coach, in the third series of the game, you made the change of quarterback and you didn't look back. How did Cade Klubnick change this game for your team? Yeah, well, we went into the game saying we were going to play him on the third series. You know, we hoped DJ would start off well. He didn't. And uh, so Cade came in and did a heck of a job. You know, and I'm really proud of him. And, uh, you know, the reality is we wouldn't have won the Atlantic and we wouldn't have been here tonight without DJ. And we wouldn't have won the ACC championship without Cade. And so, listen, man, it's, it's awesome to see uh, this young man grow up. Uh, and, you know, we, we tried to make the change at Notre Dame. Wasn't quite ready. And uh, DJ bounced back with a kind of against the wall and played well against Louisville and Miami. And then, uh, but tonight was the opportunity for him, and he was ready. He's worked his butt off all year. Great to see him play. Guys making plays. You know, how about old Cole Turner? Uh, you know, we've been kind of holding him. And uh, I told him we were going to need him to win the championship, and I didn't know it was going to turn out like that. But, you know, at the end of the day, man, I'm just, it's a blessing to be here. You know, seven out of eight years, I'm, I'm happy for our fans. I'm really proud of our team. And, uh, you know, we don't take it for granted. We're not entitled to be here. These kids earned their way here, and they earned the game tonight. And uh, and congratulations to North Carolina. I love Coach Brown, and uh, you know, but tonight was our night. All right. Well, congratulations on the win, Coach. I'm going to talk to your quarterback over here. Cade, you come in during the third series of the game, and you absolutely take over. How are you able to be so successful and create such a spark for your offense? Yeah. Um, you know, I just think my peace comes from God, and it's simple as that. And, uh, just I, I'm so thankful for all the people that I get to be surrounded by every single day uh, Just you know whether it's the strength strength uh, strength coaches um, or you know the QB room I mean we have such a tight group uh, me and DJ have such an amazing relationship and uh, I'm just so thankful for him for the man that he's been to me and uh, for, for the role model that he's been for me um, But you know I I love football and you know, I just I just want to come out here and, and play the game I've always wanted to play uh, but you know, it's awesome your first significant amount of playing time and your first real impact on a game and it's in an ACC championship win could you ever have imagined this outcome tonight mm -hmm. no I think I, I never could have uh, but you know it's just God's time and, and it's just you know I'm so excited we're definitely gonna celebrate and uh, but just just so so excited for these guys and so excited for the seniors um, you know I think long run we didn't have the season that we wanted uh, but for them for these seniors and the guys that, that have meant so much to me for them to go out with a with a ring and the ACC championship it, it means a lot so DJ was in your ear a lot on the sidelines what was he saying to you during the game yeah I mean just helping me pick apart uh, defenses and, uh, and schemes that they've been doing and uh, just nothing but encouragement uh, just I love that dude and he's like I said he's been he's been so awesome to me since I got here and, um, just uh, I'm super thankful for him all right congrats on the win Kate thank you so much Sean let's go